But we're staying on politics. Stakeholders of the All Progressives Congress in Adamawa State have resolved to work for the victory of the party's presidential candidate, Ashiwaji Bola Ametinubu. Correspondent Wola Biadenusi filed in this report. Key players in All Progressives Congress in Adamawa are hopeful that Bola Ahmed Tinubu will win next year's presidential election in the state. They have been going round the nooks and crannies of the state to gain a vote for the party as its candidates in the state. At this courtesy call by the people of Minchika on the party secretariat in Yola, chairman of Tinubu's Yatima campaign coordinator in the state kicked against the recent outburst of Baba Chirilawan's position on Shetima's choice as Tinubu's vice on Sen religion. He explained that many Christian leaders have begun sensitizing members on the need to vote for Tinubu and the party's gubernatorial candidate for competency, not religion. The, the likes of Reverend Abraham Wuta, they used to go church to church. Now they are going to go church to church in our favor. What? So what? these are the convincing reasons why we stated our unalloyed support to the party. In fact, I have never seen a time where voluntary associations and organizations are coming up on a daily basis to promote the Asiwaju Kashim ticket like now. The party state publicity secretary and other speakers give reasons why Nigerians should vote Tinubu and APC gubernatorial candidates in the state. We want to assure His Excellency Ahmed Bola Tinubu and Kashim Shetima that come 2023 general election, Mitika belongs to him. Uh, our preparation now, we are going unit to unit, word to word, talking to our people, conversing votes. We are trying to make a, a group of youths, women and elders so that we, we enlighten our people. Politics is not about a religion or ethnic or whatever. Politics is about dividend of democracy. Political analysts believe that the growing support for the Tinubu and Shetima ticket in Adamawa will pose a substantial threat to the ambition of former Vice President Atiku Abubakar. 